Hi guys, I'm Cool Math Gamer, and today we're playing Red. Now, I played this earlier, and frankly, it was very, very, very boring. In fact, I'd prefer a poke, a poke in the eye with a blunt stick before you play this game, okay? So if you're about to play it, change the game, okay? It's just, yeah. But anyway, the theory is you've got to um, use your mouse to, to basically solve the puzzle that's on the screen. Now, it sounds all good, but it's not, okay? It's just not. I haven't given bad reviews before, but frankly, this is terrible. Look, every time you click this button, it cards a new square. Once the whole screen's red, you've got it. See, this one here, you pull it down, the whole screen goes red. You got it. Thermometer. Let's pull the thermometer. Wait, the whole screen goes red. Frankly, um, it, 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 it said, in theory, it sounds good, but it's not. Okay, click the square next to it, pushes them up. Okay, now this could be fun. Maybe. Maybe. Okay? But it's not. <laughs> it's just not. Okay? Here you click on one and the other one opens up. Except for the middle one. See, it's all opposites. Okay? And the whole screen's red. Here, you got to wait for the heart. When the screen goes red, you click. It goes red, it click. I'm having fun right now. Seriously, stab me in the eye with a blunt stick. It's a lot more fun than this. Um, if you click again, it'll make the heart go smaller. But frankly, like... Yeah. What were they thinking? I don't, I don't get it. The only reason I'm playing the game is because, frankly, it's my job right now. I decided to make a YouTube channel called Cool Math Gamer. What else do you do except play Cool Math Games? Here, you match them up. Wait, this way, wait, this one, this one looks like this one, wait, 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 this one looks like this one. Um, yeah. Stab me in the eye with a blunt stick, because frankly, yeah. Click on this till they're full, click on this till they're full, click on this till they're full. As you see, I've done these ones, I know what's going on, I've done up to 12, honestly. Then you click on this one, the whole screen goes red, okay? This one, then that one. This one, this one, then, uh, this one, then that one. Then as you click this one, you'll make it go to the next one. Okay? See, so, it's it. in theory, this game was a good idea. It's nearly like one of the elevator games. You know, where you have to try to solve the clues to get through the elevator. The difference is, the elevator games are actually interesting. This one, there's no graphics or anything. The screen is red. You have to make a red screen. That one to there, that one to there. That one to there, that one to there. Oh, that wouldn't work at all. Okay. Done. So you've done these ones. Ah, oh, yeah. This one turns to square every time you click this one. Yep. Yep. You see? Are you having fun yet? Or would you prefer a stab in the eye with a blunt stick? Because frankly. Um. Yeah. Yeah, you understand why I'm at level 12, and I'm pretty person. I've got a l I'm normally pretty good with these games. I don't even know how many levels there are, frankly. Okay. Okay. Okay, I don't know what's going on. I'm kind of guessing. I'm just going to keep randomly click keep clicking black squares until it's done. I don't even know what I just did then. 13, oh, we're on your level now. Make the screen goes black. Make the screen goes black. Make the screen go black. Is there anything else to click on in this screen? You see, and then you get something like this. That, you know, obviously there's a puzzle to it. But frankly, there's not enough stimulation on the screen to actually make me care about it. I mean, I've got to make this red. 
How do you make the hearts red? I got buttons to make it black. Can't push both of them at the same time. I've only got two mushrooms. Oh, you got the hint button too. Hint. Three times hearts facing up and down. Three hearts facing up, three hearts facing down. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, so you want to be to stab in the face with a blunt stick? One, two, three. This one, I don't even know how that last one. Two, three. Wait. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Let's say six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Ah, I see what's going on here. There's one heart up, two hearts up, three hearts up, four hearts up. Okay? Five hearts up. How many down? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Or you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, so up, 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 down, 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 up, down, down. Oh, stab me in the face with a blunt stick. Oh, see, miss that one out. And you see what I mean? Like, I think I'd be prefer to be doing anything right now. I'm gonna play one more level, and I'm gonna stop playing this because, frankly, this is the first game I've seen on Cool Math Games. Um, simple. Easy to program. Crap. So what's going on? Do a puzzle. Yeah. So, what else do you do? better than this right now. Alright guys, I'm just going to turn this off. Frankly, um, play any other game. 